This is Scott the Fix-It Guy. Today we have a dishwasher that is draining in kind of a weird way. The air gap up at the top is shooting water out when we set it to drain. So the dishwasher does drain, but it doesn't go out where it should. It comes out of this air gap thing here located at the left. And sometimes these will, the water will shoot out. This one kind of dribbles out. And this is due to a clog in the line that goes between the air gap and the garbage disposer, this big black tube. So I'm going to loosen up the hose, get the hose clamp off, and I'll pull this tube off and we'll see what kind of crud will come out. So stuff just builds up over time, kind of like arterial sclerosis in our arteries, that just accumulation of junk and you get an occlusion to the point where water can't flow and then it backs up through the air gap. I can see some stuff in there. So I'm going to take a screwdriver and clean out. Oh, I'm just running some water through there right now from the drain. But the water's not coming out too fast, so there might be something in there still. So I'm going to clean out some of the junk that's inside the disposer. It's kind of like coffee grounds. And then I'll use a flexible tool to go up inside that hose and just try to get all the junk out. So I, <clears throat> I got a whole bunch of crud that was inside there. Again, probably coffee grounds. You could use like a straightened um, wire clothes hanger would probably do just as good as this tool. This one has a little um, brush at the end, kind of helps get stuff out faster. Sometimes these tubes are, are uh, when they bend to come into the disposer, the bend is too severe, it causes a crimp, and that restricts the water too. So you have to keep an eye out for that. This one, I think it was just full of junk. So now I set it for drain, and a whole bunch of dirty water came out. So it's draining really good now. So I think we got it. So we're going to just take that hose, put it back on the disposer, and tighten up that hose clamp. And I think that's going to be the end of our problems. So pretty fast way to get your dishwasher draining correctly again. And it's a common problem where water comes out of the air gap, but it's just due to the hose that goes between the air gap and the disposer being either somewhat occluded or fully occluded. where water can't pass through and it'll go out the next possible point and that's the air gap. So now we're going to set it for drain and just see how it looks up, up top. So it's not shooting out of the air gap anymore and I can hear it flowing down inside the sink in the disposer which is what you want. So now we're going to set it again for drain by turning the dial. Yeah, and I can see the water shooting. That's great. I can hear it. All right, back to a healthy dishwasher with a good drain. Hope this helps you. And please subscribe to our channel when you get a chance. Thanks a lot. Bye-bye.